Hello, my beautiful crafty friends. How is everyone doing? I hope you are doing well. Today is a Timu haul, and guys, I am so excited to get into these bags, but I've been waiting on you. Where you been, girl? I've been sitting here waiting on you. Come on now. A couple of things I want to address before we dive in. Um, I know you see that stack of Sam's ribbon back there. It's gorgeous, darling. And guess what? Your girl got it on a deal for $1.97 a roll. You know Sam's ribbon is beautiful, good quality, and you get tons and tons of it. So super, super excited that I found that. There's actually two stacks because... You don't pass up a deal like that, right, ladies? Okay, I am going to do a check-in because it's been such a long time since I've done a sit-down video with you guys. I'll do a little life update, but we're not going to do that till the end of the video. So those that clicked on this video for the Timu haul can see the stuff from Timu and don't have to worry about my boring life right? Okay. There is a package that I did open because I didn't think it was part of the Timu, but I'll be dang, it was part of the Timu girls and guys. Okay. So sandals, here we go. Let's do this. Um, oh, another thing I should address because I don't want anybody to think it's me that's having the oh baby. Okay. So a coworker of mine announced today that she is pregnant. She is expecting, and I'm so excited to be along in this journey with her that I went ahead and put a little bouquet to say congratulations together. Super inexpensive. Cost 10 bucks, y'all. I was like, mm, that's what I'm talking about. So I found this little bunny at the Dollar Tree, and I just gave it a cute little different bow. Added a sweet little button back there. I do have them tied on with a rubber band. And then I just bought these little cute little bouquet of flowers at Kroger's. And then and at Dollar Tree, I found this foiled, oh baby, added some chiffon ribbon onto the little stick here just to make it a little bit prissier and cuter and girly. And then, of course, they were out of helium. I don't know if there's a helium shortage, but the only balloon left was this one. And I thought, oh my gosh, she's perfect, right? So I put this little bouquet together for her tomorrow to show how excited I am for her and congratulations. And I can't wait to be on this journey with her. Oh my gosh. So yeah, it's not me that's pregnant, y'all. I was just in the craft room putting that together. <laughs> so let's dive in. All right, are you ready? The first thing that we have is sandals. These are knockoff Birkin sandals, Birkenstock sandals. I am, um, I tried them on. And they are adjustable straps. They were definitely too loose on the foot. I tried to tighten them up, but this is my bad. These are definitely going back, but this is my bad. Since I've lost so much weight, I've actually went down in a shoe, a whole shoe size. Can you believe that? I didn't even think that was possible. So I am no longer a size 11. I am definitely a size 10. And these guys are a little too big, so I'm still on the hunt for some new sandals this season. All right, let's dive in. Now... I will say, most of this stuff is for bees, okay, some really cute bee uh, crafty goodies. I also have a lot of super duper cute Highland cow decor, and then of course we got to have earrings. It wouldn't be an Amanda video if it won earrings, and then I also have some stuff for the beaded pins. I've been into the beaded pins. Thank you, TikTok. No, don't think TikTok. I got to stay off the TikTok shop, y'all. It's a problem. Um, but with that being said, we are redoing our bathroom. As you guys know, I love to decorate with farmhouse and buffalo check and all that great stuff. So I, since we're redoing our bathroom from scratch, y'all, like the walls, the tile, the floor, the vanity, the toilet, the everything, right? I thought I'm going to do my bathroom in Highland Cow. It's so perfect. And there's some cute bathroom Highland Cow stuff on Timu and I cannot wait to show you. And I hope it's as good as I think it is. Oh my gosh. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to dive into this big bag and girl, get you a drink get you a snack and sit back because we are about to get into it and it might be a long one okay your girl is chatty she's had her caffeine today and i'm excited oh these are even better than i thought they were gonna be oh my gosh so i got heat transfer little cows so that I could do my own DIYs if I wanted to, or make little t-shirts, or, you know, you could do so many dang things with them, and they're so inexpensive. You guys, they are so dang inexpensive, it's insane. But look at these prints. 
Are you kidding me? Look at the babies. Oh, I cannot. So is this one's a female, this one's a male. Wait, hold on, yeah. Female, male, baby cow. Oh, my heart, my flippin' heart. Look at these transfers. Are you freaking kidding me? Aren't they so good? They're so good. Oh, I cannot wait. This one right here, the little plaid, the sunflowers, they'll be good going into the fall as well. These are good. These are so good, and I am so excited for them. Because what I have realized, and the thanks to Timu, is that heat transfer is not just good for fabric, but you can actually do it on like wood pieces and stuff too, which is super duper exciting. Oh, yes. Okay, so this one... I thought was the most adorable. So he is a big fella and he is on the toilet, taking a dookie and reading his newspaper. It's rustic, it's metal, it's a good size, I like it. Now, I am not scared to return anything. In fact, these things that I bought, some of it I may return because I know I gotta return the, um, the sandals but Timu makes it so freaking easy for returning stuff that you aren't into. So I I purchased with the thought in mind that if it doesn't work out, they will be going back. I am not going to waste my money. <gasps> you guys, these are so cute. Okay, so they come in this little tube. They are protected. And they are on a canvas, which is very... Um, didn't expect that. So... They are little bathroom Highland Cow Highland Cow canvases. Look at the baby. He just got out of the bath. Of course, I can get my own frames to match my bathroom, which I'm fine for. Uh, look at this. Are you kidding me? How cute. So there's one, two. There, it must be a four pack. They do have a little bit of a smell for sure. Ah, look at him. I cannot wait to show Kev. Oh my gosh, they're so good. I think Kev's going to be, I think Kev's okay with this. Look at that one. So just picture like a little four um, trio and frames on the wall. Oh, these are so good. Plus they got the gray tones to them. There's a little bit of a pop of color, but not much, but I love it. I love it. I love it. So this is part of a guest bathroom. So these are where my guests will be going. Okay, so let's see what's in here. I did a lot of like Highland Cow print. Oh, it's another Highland Cow print. But this one is on canvas as well, which is great. I am here for it. What is this one? Oh, you guys, the quality. I am so shook. Look at the baby. Oh, my heart. With the little four, um, taking a shower, taking a dookie, taking all the things with his little toilet paper. Look at the quality. That is such good quality. Oh, my mercy. And the toilet paper in the background. He's been ornery, y'all. Oh, that's good. That's really good. This one must be an 11... I'm going to say 11 by 12. I, I maybe it could be an 8 by 10. Not too sure. It is what it is. Who cares? Let's keep going. Staying on the cow theme. This stinks because this got um, wrinkled. How funny would it be to lift up the toilet seat? <laughs> you come over. You're like, oh, can I use your bathroom? I'm like, of course. And you go in my bathroom and you lift up the toilet seat and you see this face. <laughs> Tell me that wouldn't be everything. Oh my gosh, I love him. He is cute. It looks like he might be a window clean, like kind of like a sticker. I'm loving it. Okay, so then I got some different options in here. So what is this? This is, okay, so I am into the beaded stuff that I was telling you about. I wish I could show you a beaded pin. But they also have options for, like, beaded keychains. So you put your beads on here, and then it's like a gift. 
and then they have what they call our focals, which is like, I'll show you. I'm sure I got a focal or two in here. So that's what that is. What is this? Okay, so this must be like a kit. You get the cellophane bag, you get the cardboard to put it on, you get the keychain, and then you can gift it, which is really cool. I've noticed that this TikTok shop, they got to be buying it somewhere, right? So these girls are going on there and they are um, buying a bulk of bead or like a set of beads, a set of focals, a set of pens. There's putting these pens together and then they're turning and they'll buy it for like a dollar for their bulk of beads, a dollar for like six focals, and then a dollar for like six pens. And then they're turning around and selling them for five to six bucks and they are hot commodity. Let me tell you what. So I said, you know what? I can do this on my own. I can so do this on my own. I was to the point where I was wanting to buy a pen for every coworker that matches their personality. And I was like, you know what? No, I can do this on my own. Of course. So earrings, we got earrings. I need to freshen up my little earrings. I love these earrings. I wear them all the time. They're perfect for summer and they are amazing. Okay, so this isn't what I thought it was going to be at all, but it's so good. It says, why, hello, sweet cheeks, have a seat. But I thought it was going to be a lot bigger than that, and then it comes with some twine to hang. So I'll probably keep, the thing is, as I think there's a time frame that you have to um, return these within, and I don't know how far we are from decorating that bathroom. So I might have boo-booed a bit. <laughs> because I don't know if I'm going to have room for a little all of this stuff. And I'm not, like I said, I'm wanting to return what I don't want to keep. Once again, we have more prints. But these are definitely black and white. Other like those canvases. With these in frames, I'm sure this might be a little bit better. These are a different size. These look like they are an 8 by 10 and I cannot get them out of the dang packaging. So we're just going to rip them a bit. <laughs> just a tiny bit. Lord of mercy. Come on, cow. Come on with it. Okay. So he is looking out the window. So cute. He's just had his bath. These are definitely not as good quality as the other ones. I'm sorry to say you can see the misprint. It looks good on camera, but in person, it probably looked good from far away. But I don't think the detail is there, such as the canvas ones. But are you kidding me? This next one is everything. <laughs> that in a bathroom y'all come on with gray and blue tones and oh i'm so excited i cannot wait till my bathroom is done let's keep on moving girls and boys these are some more heat transfers to make my own decor if i wanted to these are also highland cows are these hand i don't think these are heat transfer i think these are regular transfer let me see. Yeah, there's two cellophane pieces here. Loving these images. These would look so good on a tumbler. That's what they were um, uh, advertised for, but also regular decor. I like them. They're cute. They're your everyday decor, not so much, you know, right in the summer. These were so cute. I could not get over these. I'm sorry if I keep saying cute, y'all, but it's just cute stuff. These were so fun. So I was thinking for the 4th of July, for DIYs, for shirts, for wood rounds, for all the things, these would be perfect. There's like a set of four, I believe, and they are um, iron-on transfers. So we have American Girly. So cute, right? And then once I realized I can put these on wood rounds and everything outside of just shirts, this one says land of the free American because of the brave. Love it. So cute. This one, so cute. American. American. Love it. Love it. Love it. And then the last one is America. This so, I mean, for a dollar forty-seven to get your own little heat transfers, and they're a good size. I thought, heck, come on, 
put it in the cart. Let's go. We're checking it on out. All right, I want to put these away. I'm sorry to take up your time, your sweet, valuable time, girl, but you got to protect them so that they're still usable, right? <clears throat> Excuse me. We got some more heat transfers. This one is a beautiful cow with her glasses. She's so cute. Now, why are they going to go put a sticker right in the front of this dang thing? Why are they going to do that for? How are, you, how are you supposed to see it? I guess it's not meant for hauls, huh? There you go. Isn't she cute? She's so sassy, so cute. I thought she'd be so adorable on a wood round or even a t-shirt and say, Hey, heifer. <laughs> I am something else. And then these, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. They're so good. So good. Look at the babies. Aren't they so sweet? These images, y'all. Ah, uh, I cannot. They're so good. Love, 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 love. I almost feel like, are those doubles? No, these are the adults. These are the babies. Okay, cool, cool, cool. One more. These are definitely a lot more cartoony. I told y'all it's going to be a Highland Cow video for sure. I'm going to have to say, oh, I'm going to have to, oh, the bucket, the baby in the bucket. Oh my gosh. I'm going to have to title this um, Highland Cow Timu Hall because it's good. That's basically what it is. But don't get me twisted. I got some goodies here. So don't just hang tight. We'll do the bees here in a moment. <clears throat> That's so cute. Metal round. Little guy holding his toilet paper. There's no way I'm going to have enough wall space for all these. So we're definitely going to have to pick and choose. Okay, so for the beaded, um, the beaded pins, I did pick up some cow print beads. I thought, you know what, if anything, if I don't put them together myself, I for the ones that I've paid so much money for, I can change out the beads too. We also, I had to, y'all. I had to, had to, had to. And now that I have them here, they're definitely not as cute as they are online. We have baby little Highland cow earrings. They're so cute, but the print on them isn't very good. They're cute though. I don't know, should we keep them? I think we should keep them. They're studs. I don't really use studs, but it is what it is. <gasps> yes! Okay, so I have some blank tumblers in there. And, and even if I don't, I didn't realize she was a Halloween baby girl. And even if I don't put her on a tumbler, oh my gosh. You guys, she's meant for a tumbler, but look at the Halloween. Isn't she cute? Look at the pumpkins. Oh my gosh. You guys, you've got to comment down below. Which one is your favorite? I need to know. Holy crap. There is no way I'm going to return that one. No, thank you. This, I've been noticing these little metal wood rounds are so good for um, wreaths, you guys. Oh my gosh, Timu is where it's at. Look at this one. It's already rustic for you. The colors are phenomenal. And it is real metal. That is everything. And it already has your holes. To attach it to your wreath. That is so good. I love that one. Yes, ma'am. Get in my stash. You can stay in my stash and I will look at you, my pretty. <laughs> That's basically what I end up doing with these guys. This is the same thing. Another concept that I was thinking. And this guy is so stinking cute. This is where it says, hey, heifer. <laughs> Isn't it cute? Look at his little smile. How can you not look at this guy and smile so big? He's good for the fall. He's good for the spring. He's good for the summer. He's just so good. You guys, I'm obsessed with Highland cows right now. And I know I'm not the only one. I know I'm not the only one. And then we got some little tiny goodies. Last thing here before I get into the baby ones. Oh, see, I thought these were bigger, but they'll be cute to redo. I got a pack of, let's see, a tin pack of wooden mason jars. So what I've noticed with Timu is that their wood is so super thin. In order for me to DIY this, I would have to um, wood glue two of them together 
and then do a little DIY with them. But these are really good size, I guess, for shelf setters, but I thought they were going to be a little bit bigger. But I'm already thinking in my head, like, what can I do with this? And y'all, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to do these little mason jars with these little Highland cows, and it's going to be so cute. So stay tuned, my friends. Stay tuned. Should we do bees first or beaded? Let's go beaded. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Okay. So this is a beaded pin pack. I'm glad you stuck with me. I did not realize that these were a beaded pack for puppies. I just wanted black. I guess it's a good thing because um, obviously you got guys at the store that um, are hard to do focals for. So we have the paw prints. We have the different puppies. We got the other paw prints that says woof woof. We got a husky. Oh, these are cute. I like those. And then they come with the pen. So you put your beads on here and you put it all together. You got bead, 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 spacers. There's spacers in there. And then you put your focal on top. This little guy just spins off and then bam, there you go. You got a cute little pin. The pins are so cute. I guess I didn't realize that these were puppies though. I was thinking they were like cow print. <laughs> are we shocked? <laughs> I'm not shocked. Are you shocked? You guys, we're 21 minutes in and we only have one bag. Holy crap. I hope you grabbed a drink, like I said. I better get to going here. Okay, so same concept, but I picked up the B version of it. Um, but this isn't for those pens. These were for like a um, uh, tassel. These were a tassel, so we got all the beaded colors, but they will work on the pens. And then they came with a cute little bee charm. And it's so cute. Oh my gosh. So, so cute. That's what I wanted to use it for. But as I look at these, these holes are definitely not as big. Well, maybe they are. So we can make some B pins. So we got puppy pins, B pins. Of course, I work for, I wanted to make sure I went for the colors that match our, um, our work. So I did red, black, white, and gray. Love these. These are so good. The rubber beads, so good. And then let's see what's in this little pocket, shall we? Love it when they put a package surprise in within a package surprise, right? Oh, okay. I know exactly what these are and I am so excited for these. These are a hundred piece, okay? These are blue little refills to put in those beaded pens and let me tell you why I bought these. I cannot stand to write with black ink. I have to write with blue ink. So all that money that I spent on them beaded pens are getting re-changed out for blue. <laughs> these are great. I knew I didn't realize what that was, but we're going to do some earrings real quick. And then we're going to jump into the little bee guys that I got um, for projects and stuff. I picked up these strawberries, and because strawberries are so dang cute, I don't like these. I don't like them. They're going to get returned. I do not like them. They're very summer. They would have matched my work, but I feel like they're too long. Yeah, I think these might be getting returned, y'all. Okay, and then here we go. We're going to get into the littler ones now. These are the cutest little earrings ever. Hopefully, they're just as cute in person. Okay, these are cute. Look at these little itty-bitty Highland cow studs. Aren't they adorable? Oh, gosh. They're so cute. I told you, I'm obsessed. Bees Highland cow. Give me all the things. We're going to do it today. <laughs> All right, so let me get right. We're down to five or six little guys, okay? So they had little itsy bitsy tiny little bees that I wanted to use for projects. And there's so many different little options for the bees, and I'm here for it. These are the bees, bees, babies. Okay, so there are different kinds of bees. And this, I wish I would have known. You guys, if you see me going like this, I'm trying to twist my rings back. Like, I, I know I hate saying it, but losing weight, my rings don't fit right. So 
So these come in several different sizes, which I wish I would have paid attention to that. They got cute little smiles. I love that they come in this itsy bitsy little pack. Looks like we have a medium, a large, and a baby. See the medium, large, and the baby? Ah, oh, cute. I think there's like 20 there. Looks like you get three big, large ones. Okay, so we got that little pack here. So cute. I cannot wait to name this Crafty Bee in Highland Cow Haw. Because y'all, it's a bead, Highland Cow Haw. <laughs> these are like a pack of 100. I think we could have got these at the Dollar Tree. I think everybody else and their mother and brother found them at the Dollar Tree. Except, except for your girl, right? So I'm trying not to break them. These are wooden. They are already stickered with the foam dot. They're so cute, y'all. Aren't they cute? They got little faces on them. They're not painted as good, but it is what it is. And then these were my favorite because they look like um, Winnie the Poobies. They're very itsy bitsy tiny. They're like an acrylic or a plastic. Oh my gosh, they're so dang cute. And then I picked up these little ones. They just have the eye, no smile, kind of acrylic looking. And then I picked up these ones. They're your front bead, B. And then I picked up these other ones, which these are adorable. And these are like cutesy baby cute. Aren't they cute? <laughs> Tell me they ain't cute. They're so cute. <laughs> and now I want to get out one of those little Dollar Tree um, organizers so I can put the different bees in each little spot. And then, of course, I had to pick up these babies. Oh, my gosh. Ah, he is everything. He's a moo cow with some um, sunflowers. He's cute. He's a lot cuter than them strawberries and them other little Highland cow earrings. My gosh. But, oh, he's cute. I hope I'm brave enough to wear that to work because it doesn't remind me of an adult. Are we ready to get into this other bag? It can't be too much more. Holy macaroni in a pot. That is a lot. Oh, one other one I picked up, but doesn't look like they're actually the way I thought they would be. Um, okay. Wow. How am I supposed to wear those? They're studs. Oh, I picked up black hearts. I thought those were super cute and they're just like a studded earring. So yeah, those are cute. We'll keep them, but they're bent. And what I hate about that is eventually the back part falls off. Right? So, but yeah, so cute. I like them. Okay. And how many times I'm going to say cute? All right, what's in here? Hopefully, it's my tray that I ordered. Oh, yeah. Okay, this won't take long, y'all. So, I picked up another pair of slides just in case those ones didn't work. I did pick, or I picked up flip-flops. I picked these up in a size 11. I think they might have been six bucks. Not bad. These are exactly what I've been looking for. So, let's give them a go. Let's see, let's see, let's see. If we are going to keep them or if they're going to, those are going to be it. I got my sandals for the, for the summer. I'm so excited. We have a box within a box, within a bag, within a bag, within a box, within a box, within a bag. Yeah, baby. See, I went to go see if my review my order and they did not say that this was going to be shipped, that I didn't order it. And I was like, what? I know I ordered it. What? What, what, what? All right, you guys, if you do not follow me on TikTok, I got a brand new farm sink that is absolutely beautiful. I mean, I love my sink. It's got one of those bar things where you push down the cup and it sprays the cup and cleans the cup. It has a waterfall to clean your veggies. It's got a little tray that holds your veggies. It's got everything and more. And I wanted to, um, have a little organization there. This will probably come out because I'm going to put it on a silicone mat and it holds my sponge, my soap, and my little scrubby doodad. So I'm hoping this one work. I already ordered another one that was a two tiered one and it didn't work very well. It didn't hold my sponges very well. 
Okay, so now let's get into some 4th of July stuff. <gasps> See, I'm, I'm a little mad, okay? I'm a little ticked because... You know how I was like, I checked my order. I didn't see this stuff in it. These are also 100 refills. There's no way I'll go through both. One of them's got to get returned. OMG. Okay, what are you? You're cute. What are you? Are you cute? <laughs> we got some nail decals here. So hold on. Let me see what this guy is. What are you? We got some clothes. <gasps> I don't remember ordering these either. I'll be dang, y'all. I ordered some summer shorts. I probably ordered them way too big. But Honey's been telling me that my shorts that I'm wearing, oh, they're good and stretchy. They told me to size up. They've been He's been telling me the shorts that I'm wearing are do not flatter me. And I probably have had them for like the last 10 years. So I thought I'd give them a go. I'm excited. I forgot about those. I can't wait to see if Honey thinks those are flattering, <laughs> which he's right. They're like four sizes too big, and it looks like I got um, droopy booty. So I picked up some nail decals. I'm excited to try these with Timu. We did them for 4th of July. There's no way I'd run through these by the 4th, but we have some fireworks ones. I'll probably put some on tonight. I love these. These are so cute. Look at these. Yep, and I love it because they are my works colors, so they go so well with the uniform. I'm excited to try those. And then this little paper pad I was obsessed with. I thought, oh my gosh, give me all the things. I want it bigger, but I guess if you're going to give it to me small, give it to me small, y'all. This paper pad with Timu actually came with a sheet of stickers. So we have the beard, the wreath, the truck, the little lady. Look at the little dog. Oh my goodness gracious me, oh my. So cute. Oh, there's more than one sheet of stickers. I love that. So you get two sets of stickers. Okay, so cute. And I just thought, you know what? This is such my vibe. This is a vibe. It's giving more than 4th of July. Ah, oh, my God. Are you effing kidding me? Give me this in a bread, a bedspread or wallpaper. Oh, are you kidding me? This is so good. I love it. This is such a vibe. It's giving patriotic. It's giving absolutely adorable. It's giving me, okay, Timu, where are you in our crafty stores? I need more access to you a lot sooner than what you ship. Oh, my goodness gracious me. Oh, to the my. So good. That is good. I cannot wait to dive in and make a project with that. That is too good, y'all. You guys, I think that's it. <gasps> did we do it? Did we do the full dang thing? Yes, we did. Comment down below if you made it through the whole thing. I want you to comment in the comments. Um, be yourself. Yeah, be yourself. That way, I know you watch to the end. And I want to know what all should I keep? Well, I'm going to keep everything Highland Counter wise for decor. But do you think I should keep these black and white that doesn't look as good of a quality? Or the black and white one or the canvas ones? These are such good quality. But I love the black and white. Oh, oy vey, I need your help. I need your help. All right, you guys, that is it. That is all. I cannot wait to start crafting with all my fun goodies. I am overwhelmed. I can't wait to put it all away. I can't stay off that app. I think they got me trapped. I should make a rhyme, but I'm not going to do it this time. <laughs> that was good. I need to stay off that app. I forget it already, girl. All right. Anyways, thank you so much for hanging out with me today. I hope you all are doing well. I'm going to let those that don't care about what my life update is go right on now. Thank you so much for watching. You're absolutely amazing. Updates for everyone else. A, I did not get the job promotion. I am super, super devastated over it. I worked my butt off. I've been with this company for eight years. I worked my butt off to try to show that I am more than capable, 
for doing this position, especially within the last two years. And I wanted it so, so bad. It was talked about. It was in the last two years. It was reminisced about when it's your turn, when it's your option, when it becomes available. And it became available. And I did bomb the interview. However, the hiring manager, someone who I work with on a daily basis, who I've known for probably the six out of the eight years that I worked with the company, knows me in and out to the point where I thought for sure, okay, I definitely still have a fighting chance. Well, didn't get it. I am super devastated. So it is what it is. Anyways, my son, Mr. Landon Paul, I am so, so, so excited, so excited for this kid. He's sworn into the Air Force, y'all. It's official. My baby is going to serve our country, and he takes his test this Friday and gets a ship out date right after, I'm assuming. So please say a little prayer for my baby boy that he gets shipped off fine and everything will go through boot camp fine and tech school and all the things. I will be making a trip to Texas to tap my baby boy out, and I'm so excited for it. I'm starting to save up now, all that fun stuff, you know. So, yes, everyone tell the Landon congratulations in the comments. We're so proud. My mama heart is so worried, though, guys. Oh, my gosh. I am more than beyond proud of this child, but I'm also like, okay, our country isn't so good right now, kids. So, you know. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> bathroom is so close to being redone. We got the um, tub was sprayed. We decided to spray the paint on it and stuff. And then we got the floor picked out. We got the vanity picked out. I need to go get a big round farmhouse mirror. I'm so excited for it. And it's going to be in Highland Cal. Did I tell you guys that? <laughs> I'm just kidding. These are good quality, y'all. I can't believe I didn't give nothing but six bucks for these. These are good quality. Oh my gosh. And they're simple. They're black. They'll go with everything. <sighs> Finally, I haven't been able to find thin without heels. Flip flops like this in our stores, y'all. I haven't been able to find them. So I'm so excited. <laughs> All right. Anyways, I took so much of your time. I'm so sorry. I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. Until next time, you guys are amazing and you know it. Let me know if you're enjoying the lives or if you missed the sit down videos. Okay, you guys, I will talk to you later. Bye-bye, my crafty friend.